Welcome back boys and girls. One of my favorite stories is one of the three little pigs and we've read this before lots of times with the wolf puffing and puffing. So let's see if this is similar to one of our other stories. This was retold or illustrated by Ed Bryan. Now, once upon a time, there were three little pigs. The time had come for the three little pigs to leave their home and make their way in the world. Goodbye, my little ones. Be happy, but beware of the big bad wolf, said their mother. And so the three little pigs went on their way. The first little pig quickly built himself a house made out of straw. The second little pig quickly built herself a house made out of sticks. But the third little pig decided to build their house out of bricks. So he worked hard and his house took a long time to build. The three little pigs lived happily in their three houses until one day the big bad wolf arrived at their neighborhood. Bang, bang, bang. The wolf knocked at the door of the first little pig. Little pig, little pig, may I come in? said the big bad wolf. Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin, said the first little pig. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, growled the wolf. So the big bad wolf huffed and puffed and blew the house down. And the little pig ran squealing to his sister's house with the wolf racing after him. Now the big bad wolf knocked at the door of the second little pig. Bang, bang, bang. Little pig, little pig, may I come in? Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin, said the second little pig. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, growled the wolf. So the big bad wolf huffed and puffed and he blew the house down. And the little pigs ran squealing to their brother's house with the wolf racing after them. So the big bad wolf knocked on the door of the third little pig. Little pig, little pig, may I come in? Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin, said the third little pig. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, growled the wolf. So... The wolf huffed and puffed and huffed and puffed, but the bricks didn't fall down. So the big bad wolf was angry and hungry. So he climbed up on the roof and he squashed himself into the chimney. Now, the moment the third little pig heard the wolf on the roof, he knew exactly what to do. What do you think they do? He put a very big hot of water, pot of water on the stove to boil. And just as the big bad wolf slid down the chimney, the little pig pulled the lid off the hot pot of water and in dropped the wolf. The big bad wolf burned his bottom very badly and he ran howling down the road. He was never ever seen again. But the three little pigs lived happily ever after. And that's the end of this story of the three little pigs. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you haven't heard the other versions, you can search them into YouTube or on Flipgrid. Stay well.